The world is a place of plenty, and nowhere is it more evident than at Slow Foods Salone del Gusto, a biennial event in Turin, Italy. The multitude of foods on display here are produced by small farmers, and the message they bring is that the future of all this splendor is in their hands, a fact appreciated by the most food-passionate people on the planet and off. Beamed in to take part in this panel discussion organized for the food event is Italy's first female astronaut, Samantha Cristoforetti, just one month before her mission on the International Space Station, 250 kilometers above the Earth's surface. Food is also culture, tradition, linked to the place we come from. And so I wanted my choice of foods to deliver a message and generate discussion about this reality. Stefano Palato is the chef behind the special meals known as bonus foods that European astronauts like Samantha can take aboard the space station. He believes small-scale farmers are the lifeblood of the world's food cultures, and by sending the unique foods they produce into outer space, he's helping to amplify their importance. Which is why he's interested in the International Fund for Agricultural Development, or IFAD, the United Nations agency that works with small-scale farmers in developing countries. All the bonus food that Samantha will carry on board will be interpreted as a symbol to thank all of those smallholder farmers that preserve these traditions. Stefano works in the kitchen at Argotech, an aerospace engineering firm that is also responsible for creating the bonus foods. Preparing meals for consumption in outer space is no easy task. It requires science, technology, and thermal engineering. There's no refrigerator to store food on the space station, so researchers at Argotech developed ways of eliminating any kind of bacterial pathogens by freeze-drying ingredients. Sourcing varieties of organic, nutritious foods is essential, and Stefano is always on the lookout for new ingredients, like these from small farmers in developing countries working with IFAD-supported projects. Understanding that small-scale producers work in a healthy, unsophisticated way, in close contact with and respectful of the environment, means preserving our food culture heritage. Because in the end, according to astronaut Samantha Cristoforetti, our health and food traditions depend on preserving agricultural biodiversity, a fact as evident in space as it is here on the ground, in the food pavilions at the Salone del Gusto.